851 time for weekend break. Let's check in with Marcella Raymond. Hey Marcella. Hey guys, what is it in dogs and cheese? I, I never <laughs> heard of that, but I'm typically a cat person, but dogs, these dogs love like a stick of mozzarella. Oh yeah. It's awesome. And this is Harvey. And we're at one tail at a time. And um, this rescue just rescued Harvey and a bunch of other dogs from uh, just outside of Austin where they had all those troubles with the storms. And so they've been up here for a while. Stacy Price is the medical director. So tell us. <laughs> Please don't choke on the, <laughs> on the cheese, no. So tell us when you get them up here before they're ready for adoption, what do you check them out for? Yeah, um, so they get off the van and the first thing that we do is microchip them um, and just kind of give them a good once over. Uh, also, we'll give them their flea and heartworm prevention. Then we put them into foster homes um, and give them a kind of chance to decompress. They've already been on a 20 plus hour car ride. Right. Um, and then they will come to us, the medical team, and we will go ahead and do a blood draw, test them for heartworm, which is really common down south. Uh, we will also up to date the, any vaccines that need updated, and then also any additional things, x-rays, blood work, whatever we need to do to get them kind of on their road to adoption. And you find that, I mean, coming from Texas, it's so different. You know, maybe they've been on a farm or out with a lot of land and now they're in a city apartment or a house. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely an adjustment, not for a dog like Harvey, apparently, who's just super social and lovely. Um, but we have dogs who sometimes have never been in a house before or have never even like heard a garbage truck before. Oh, um, wow. So our foster homes are really key in kind of teaching them about city living. We had one dog who came up on the transport who had never seen a television turned on before. <gasps> um, so, so freaked out every time <laughs> a TV was on. So we spend a lot of time. He's like, just give me the food. Right. <laughs> I don't want to talk to you anymore. Just give me the food. So we spend a lot of time, or our fosters actually spend a lot of time, kind of getting them used to okay. what life is going to be like um, and helping them decompress. Okay, so this is how you can adopt one of these beauties. We've had just great dogs on this morning. Just temperaments are awesome, and they're just so much fun. We are at um, one tail at a time. So go online, pick out a dog, easy peasy. I'll be back in the next hour with more pups for you.